syarikat dan usahawan di negeri ini perlu mengadaptasikan pendigitalan dalam perniagaan agar mampu bersaing sekaligus meningkatkan kecukupan operasi perniagaan. Ke arah itu peranan yang dimainkan oleh S1 Asia Pack dalam ekonomi digital negara amat bertepatan membantu mempercepatkan pembangunan penggunaan teknologi terutamanya di Sabah. We know that uh, the state government is very, very supportive of this digital transformation, not only to help the businesses, but help to help the younger generation for the, to, to start their businesses on the right track with using digitalization so that they can leapfrog, leapfrog because now everything is e-commerce, everything is online businesses. So the way to go forward is to learn as much as possible of the Internet of Things, my da data, the big data, and uh, AI, and so on. Pengurusi Institut Kajian Pembangunan Sabah IDS, Datuk Edeline Leong berkata kepada media selepas S1 Asia PAC Customer Conference 2022 di Kota Kinabalu. Persidangan dirasmikan setiap usaha politik kepada Menteri Sains Teknologi dan Inovasi Sabah, Senator Noraini Idris, mewakili Menteri Sains Teknologi dan Inovasi Sabah, Datuk Yaakob Khan. Nowadays, people keep talking about, you know, digital transformation, digital world, uh, internet of things. So, uh, businesses nowadays are almost universally uh, going towards digital transformation. So business communities must be able to adapt to the changes uh, in order to achieve best result. Otherwise, they will be left behind and they wouldn't be able to compete with their business competitors, uh, more so to compete in the global market. Siri pendidikan S1 Asia PAC meliputi webinar pembelajaran sepanjang hayat dalam talian untuk tenaga kerja dan program MyRiskill. Pencapaian tertinggi MyRiskill S1 Asia PAC pada tahun lepas berjaya melatih 200 syarikat untuk menerima transformasi digital dalam ruang agritech atau tech farming.